Hey, we're back with another unboxing. This is uh, the APIC, which is the uh, central uh, management component of Cisco's ACI. It's critical. Uh, it comes in a cluster, uh, minimum cluster of three. Uh, so let's go ahead and uh, get this guy unboxed and we'll talk about it a little bit more. So uh, Cisco ACI is uh, a holistic uh, network. It's very different from the uh, traditional model of managing each endpoint. Um, this is uh, managed as a fabric all your switches plug in and auto provision uh, based on what the uh, what the APIC tells it to do. Um, so this is really the heart of everything. The, the good news is that it is uh, a management station and if, it, if the APICs are offline, the system will continue to function. Um, it's not in line for, for, for data planes. Now let's take a look at the rack kit, see what we have in here for rack kit. Okay, so this one looks like one that's just going to potentially uh, connect right into your rack without requiring any uh, any rack nuts. It's got uh, it's got some uh, bolts that look like they'll fit right in, so that should be convenient. So um, let's see. So the application policy infrastructure controller is uh, the controlling piece, and you have your Nexus 9000 series switches, which are your ACI spines and leaves. Um, there's all of your leaves connect to spines. Um, all of your external posts and, and networking connect to leaves. So uh, the idea is it's a class network. Everything is uh, equally distant from each other. You know, everything just hops up to a spine and then goes right back to the other leaf. And uh, so it's very consistent connectivity, uh, latency uh, as workloads move around the data center. All right, so you have your uh, your KVM blade, uh, cabling, some Ethernet, uh, console cable, dual power cords. Very good. Um, so some of the things that you can do with ACI, some of the benefits, uh, automation. Um, you, you you basically define application data flows within the fabric, and uh, you can uh, these workloads can then move around, and the policy follows them around. Um, it, it works for both physical and virtual environments. Um, it extends into a uh, hypervisor, um, a switch like the Cisco AVS, uh, the, the VMware VDS. Um, let's see what else. Uh, it has multi tenancy built in. Um, okay, so here's the rear. We've got. Uh, We've got some. Uh, we've got a couple of uh, SFP Plus ports, uh, which you connect into the fabric. Uh, a couple of USBs, Ethernet. Uh, you may recognize this looking very much like a UCSC series, which of course it is. Uh, a couple of dual 770 watt, 770 watt AC power supplies. You want to pull one of those power supplies? To take a look. Okay, so we got ourselves a hot plug power supply. Okay, thank you. Other side in the other minute. Okay, so on this side we got a uh, 120 gig uh, SATA drive, and then we've got uh, let's see, dual 10K SAS uh, 600 gig spinning disks, and a, a whole bunch of blanks. And then there's our console cable. There's your part number. The uh, this is the APIC M2. The M2 is a means it's a generation two. Uh, APIC and the M means it's medium size, which is optimized for up to a thousand edge ports. Um, so yeah, you want you want to you want to try and pull a pull an SSD? Take a look, quick look, or pull pull a drive? Oh you, you, yeah, yeah. We'll Look, see if you can pull a drive. Uh oh, there we go. Right, there's your spinning disk. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let's uh, go ahead and do. Uh, let's take a look inside. Um, Let's see if we got some uh, some stats what we have in this guy. All right, so this guy is going to have a uh, the medium has a dual E5 2609 B3 uh, CPUs 85 watts um, 
six core, 15 meg cache, uh, 16 gigs DDR4, and then it's got the VIC uh, 1225 dual port uh, SFP network adapter. So, uh, as you can see, we got our uh, we got our four uh, four sticks of memory and uh, bank zero, or uh, then we've got our six fans, dual CPUs. Here is our, our VIC 1225, and I think that's about it on the hardware. Uh, let's see if there's anything else we should talk about. I think that's it. Hope you enjoyed this unboxing and uh, hope you get a chance to play with ACI.